Oh, oh, what the hell? We what? Oh my god, I didn't even see that. What the hell? Today is the day we're finally getting ourselves a Megalodon. I know, it's it's only been a little while, and we found a 140 a couple episodes ago, so hopefully we can find something better, or maybe even just that. We'll see. But first, dead body backflip time. This is the best. I just love that I can do that. Anyway, uh, just ignore this guy. Yeah, we, we had to... I had to end my own life when I came in because I was stuck into the ground, which is a fantastic little bug. Uh, absolutely love it. I've got everything that I think I'm going to need for this little adventure. Um, I don't know. Would I... Would wearing my scuba tank... Oh, it actually does help because I'm really cold right here. So let's go ahead and just put on some of that. What if I do this? Yeah, no, the scuba tank really is helping. Okay, cool. So I think I have everything I'm going to need. In fact, one thing before we head off, I think I should quickly just check it out. I did have a really good Megalodon saddle, but I never actually checked to see if I had a blueprint. And I'm not even sure if I do. Uh, yeah, I don't think I do. Right? Oh, no, I do. Okay, and yeah, no, it's not very good, though. Okay, yeah, my saddle's much better. Cool. Alrighty, let's head off. We're looking for a high-level Megalodon, because eventually having a little Megalodon pack would be super useful in the ocean. Um, because obviously on the island, you know... Alphas are the way to get black pearls, and we're gonna need to eventually be just slaughtering them like crazy so we can have a ton of black pearls for uh, for tech and everything all the way down the road. But for the moment, not super useful. Um, anyway, we should try to at least work on this as we go forward, and just having a Megalodon would be pretty useful because I think at some stage I do want to also try to maybe tame up an anglerfish because uh, silica pearls are kind of a pain to get right now. Anyway, so, um, yeah, we're gonna head all the way over here, and hopefully we can find something. But guys, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button if you enjoy this one, and, uh, yeah, let me make the journey. Ooh, we don't want to fall a ton. Already taken some fall damage, I don't want to take more. Alrighty, so we made it to the ocean, let's see what we can find. So, we did actually find a 140 Megalodon not too long ago. I'm not gonna hold out hopes that that thing's still out here somewhere, though, because realistically, it's probably not. Um, you know, like, Axe could have killed it. This is right beside where he lives. He could have killed it. He could have tamed it. You know, so many things could have happened. It could have also just, like, respawned or, or, sorry, despawned. Um, so, yeah. One thing that I've been getting a lot of comments about is the fog command, which I might actually do just because I'm curious. I, I've never done that in the water, so I guess... Let me grab that real quick. I can't even remember what it is. I think it's, like, R dot fog, is it? Yeah, there we go. Uh, and then we do zero, I guess. Wait, no, no, the other one said zero as well. Yeah, let's do zero on this one. What does that look like? Does that just make it? Qu oh, wow, okay. Huh. Well, that makes the actual scuba goggles useful. I mean, like if they if they look like this when you do that, or like you know, I don't know when you put them on. If they look like this, that would be great. Does it look any different? This is so stupid. What the hell is the point of the goggles now? They don't even actually... I mean, you saw a second ago. They made no difference. This is insane, though. Wow. Yeah, no, you can see everything. I mean, like, damn, they've done some good work on the ocean, and then they just... They want to hide it, I guess. I, I don't know. I, there's no point. It's really silly. Um, I can actually see around, though, a little bit, which is kind of nice. I don't know if I honestly want to constantly be doing that command, but... I don't know. It, it is kind of nice to actually be able to see a little bit. I feel like having the scuba goggles on should do this anyway. You know, like, what the hell's the point of them? Didn't they used to do this anyway a little bit? Uh, yeah, they're all, like, level 25. Hmm. Interesting. Alrighty. Well, we're going to be taking a little look around to see if we can find a high-level one. Um, there's a lot of megalodons in the ocean. I feel like I can be a little bit... Oh, that's a Dunkley. I feel like I could definitely be a little bit, um, you know, particular with the level that I'm looking for, because there's a lot of them in here, and realistically, they'll probably find me before I find them. And that's a huge amount of Plessis down here. We got, like, three of them. Do they still spawn in packs, I wonder? Level... Wait, what did that say? 65? Okay. Remember... Yeah, they spawned at, like, level 35 on, on um on the the old cluster even though they shouldn't have for some reason plessies were like the one creature that could spawn at a random weird level and i think it was specifically was like 35 very very strange anyway let's see um we got an angler fish right there which is great honestly like this is what the ocean should look like with the goggles on why does it not look like this wild card what did you do why does it look really really hard to see through um it also kind of looks like nighttime right now is it no, it, wow. It, that looks like almost like moonlight up there. That's crazy. All right, let's go ahead and get this dude killed. 
um i'm not sure if i'm going to continue to collect all these teeth because guaranteed by the end of this episode we're probably going to have like 20 billion um and also the barry is going to stop automatically grabbing them at a certain point so yeah anyway we're gonna we're gonna take a little look and see if we can manage to find a nice little megalodon to tame up and uh yeah hopefully we can do that but uh, yeah i can't really see a huge amount of them around here i can kind of see things in the distance but that's mostly angler angler fish so yeah let's uh let's head up closer to the coast they actually seem to be more common over here 35 and 25 all right let's just keep going i'm not gonna kill every single one of them we're just gonna swim around a bunch i have to say i'm pretty glad that i used this command because it says this is a lot nicer to look at uh even though it is a little bit cheaty uh you know it's not an actual admin sheet it's just a console sheet anybody can do it you can do it on official servers for some reason i don't know why <laughs> anyway so yeah i don't know whatever you think about it like it's gonna help the video a little bit because you know without this it would have been really really dark and hard to see so yeah anyway let's uh let's continue like don't get me wrong i don't mind that we can't see super far but i feel like the scuba goggles should help a little bit but they don't at all really silly hello Ooh, we got an alpha hello i've never actually like seen the details on the alpha i can't tell if the neck is chunkier it looks maybe a little bit it's hard to tell all right let's get in here let's kill that thing also hello you can't see your level yet there we go terrible but yeah very very nice would definitely like a basilo at some point as well actually like all the ocean creatures are pretty useful um yeah i feel like maybe if we had a megalodon pack doing caves with them would probably be the best but um only having like one creature i would say probably basilo is the best thing to use then in that case plus we get a little bit of oil as well actually so yeah pretty good let's go ahead and just kill this dude maybe he'll give me some nice loot he will not give me any black pearls but that's all good we'd need to kill um tussos and megalod or I'm sorry no moses there we go <laughs> we need to kill tussos and moses to get the black pearls but again we don't even need those anytime soon um here we go come on bruh it doesn't really look very chunkier i mean he's definitely bigger but he it's he doesn't have like the same effect that the um the carno and and the raptor and the rex all have where they have like a big ass neck i'm actually really excited to see the alpha death worm and see its its neck <laughs> and maybe also the wyvern as well actually all right let's get in here come on let me get you here we go it's getting a little bit bloody but still a long ways to go i think how close are you because i feel like we've been doing this for ages okay yeah we're getting pretty close this next one no this one hey there we go nice all right we got it killed finally took ages uh but we did get the nice little uh dorsal fins awesome um i should probably also get healing too and all those levels can go into melee nice okay cool so yeah gonna continue my search now um what time is it yeah it's still daytime it looks so dark down here it really does it's crazy okay i'll take that that cannot be the same one though because we're pretty far away yeah that's definitely a different one also i'm not even sure of the gender i got a couple megalodons over here though let me just check them real quick that's not a megalodon yep <laughs> it's a dunkley all right so 140 yeah we'll go for that let's um let's try and lead it over here a little bit yeah you're trying to join the party aren't you don't really want you though do we let's see if i can kill you real quick uh okay i gotta leave my other one away i guess maybe crossbowing at you would be a better idea so i don't potentially hurt my one yeah let's do that boom okay maybe i'll chase him down a little bit now as well so yeah we'll uh we'll get this thing knocked out close to the coast just so we don't have to potentially deal with things coming at it although just in general i feel like it probably wouldn't even be an issue it just might be handier because then i can actually stand out on land and not waste my oxygen tank even further but um yeah let's get this thing knocked out just gotta kill this dude first oh my god you're so persistent i just like i don't want to be friends with you i'm so sorry but like you're not a good enough level we can never be friends level 90 like you're like a day one tame if anything anything after that you're just you're just fodder really um there we go we got it nice <laughs> all righty let's get over here then come on bruh let's do it you and me all righty so yeah 140 pretty good we'll definitely uh we'll definitely take that that's gonna be very very useful um come on let me get you a little bit further over here we actually didn't even have to go that far we're kind of like at the long beach right now um on the uh, on the western side of the map so 
yeah, didn't really have to travel a super crazy amount. I was just going around, like, killing some of them. But, uh, yeah, there we go. We, we got a really good one. I appreciate this. Thank you very much, Arc Gods. Uh, how close are you to being knocked out, I wonder? Uh, did I definitely did not hit that one, though. Did I? There we go. Come on, bro. Let me get you over here maybe a little bit. Okay, let's see. All right. Uh... This is, I think, somewhat safe. Oh, yeah, you're torpor running, maybe. Or maybe you're just running because you're trying to get away. Potentially. Let's shoot it again. There we go. Okay, I think I'm going to check it with the uh, with the magnifying glass real quick. Let's see. How close are you? Come on. Oh, yeah, you're pretty close. You're also quite hurt, but you'll be fine. We'll, uh, we'll get you knocked out. We'll get you all knocked out and ready to go. Okay, pr probably, uh, I don't know, maybe like about five more arrows, I would say. I guess I could check it again real quick. It's like right here. Oh yeah, no, even less. Okay, there we go. Maybe one more. Oh, there we go. Nice. Okay, perfect. So let's see. Is there going to be anything wanting to attack? More than likely, if they are wanting to attack, they're going to wait till I'm like right beside it and then come on over. Is that a, I thought that was like a golden dolphin. That was weird. Um... I think we're pretty good. Do you see another Megalodoodle, level 60? Yeah, I think we're okay. There's some eels out there, but I feel like they probably won't be an issue. Also, I've heard that they did something to the eels, and now that they're, they're like, a lot less uh, feisty and everything. I don't know if that's actually true, but, yeah, I, I guess we'll find out eventually. I mean, anything that they could have done to the eels could only be a good thing. I hate those things. All right, let's see. Megalodon, there we go. And you are not draining a crazy amount. So yeah, you're you're good. We're gonna pretty much just sit out here at the coast, I would say. I'll give it some kibble. I think I looked it up earlier. I think a 150 would have been five kibble, so we'll just put in five kibble anyway, because it's probably gonna be the same amount. Uh ooh, there we go. So five kibble for you. And let me get on out of here. Super out of stamina right now. Should have brought a chair with me. In case you didn't know, if you if you just bring a chair into the ocean, you can place it underwater. You can sit down on it and regain your stamina. Uh, although sometimes, there we go. We actually did get our stamina back after hopping back onto the Bowery. There's like a weird bug where you'll just lose it when you're in the water for some reason. But um, yeah, there we go. So we're just going to pretty much sit here, wait for this thing to be ready without my oxygen tank on. Perfect. And yeah, we're just going to just gonna wait here. Super peaceful area. Also, what is happening with, like, the pink sand? That is crazy looking. Like, I used to live here before. The pa the sand was not pink back in my day. <laughs> this is way different. What the hell did they do? Oh, sweet. We just got it tamed. I just had to kill that Megalodon there. That thing got really close to my guy. And it was basically just about to be tamed. But, yeah, there we go. Nice. Uh, I think it actually should have an extra piece of kibble in here. Unless it's eaten it. Yes, it has. Awesome. It only actually took four pieces, so... Yeah, now what the hell do I do with you? Because we can't we can't bring the two of these guys around. This is the issue. We don't have cryopods anymore. I can't just like put you away. Um let me put you up here. <laughs> like, I could bring the Barry with me, and there's probably no issue doing that, but I don't know. I kinda just want to use the Megalodon for the moment. So yeah, let me not get you up there, because I guess I can't jump that high. Let me see. Let me go around here. We'll just leave you right there on neutral. Let's do that. Boom. This new scuba gear is wild, man. Look at that. Also, with the uh, with the riot gauntlets, it actually feel like it suits a little bit, right? I don't know. It's still weird to me how they never actually added in any sort of, like, scuba gauntlets or, or gloves or something. I guess people, when they're scuba diving, they don't really wear anything on their hands, do they? I don't know. I feel like every single shark attack video I've watched, people are just like barehanded touching things. So yeah, anyway, I think maybe if you're going super deep, probably wearing gloves or something is, is definitely something that you do though. Anyway, doesn't really matter. What are we even talking about this for? Let's go ahead and kill some things. We got we got a nice little juicy, uh, what are they called? Lead sickness over here. I thought it was an alpha from far away actually, but it's not. Let's go ahead and kill you. Get some delicious uh, freaking prime fish stuff oh my god yeah you're bleeding like hell as well wow yeah the blood actually looks pretty good in the water yeah i like that a lot you know they really could do a lot to the sharks to make them much better than they are now um i think one thing i've mentioned so many times in the past is you know the way that the dire wolves have like that whole ability where they can sense that something is low on health 
why can't sharks do that too? I feel like that would make sense, you know, because they can kind of, I don't know, sense or smell blood from really, really far away. So they should be able to detect when creatures are getting low on health. I just, I feel like they should be the dire wolves of the ocean, you know? Um, but yeah, maybe it's just me. I guess it is just me. Wild card never listens. All right, come on. Did I, I don't know if I actually got the kill on that. I definitely didn't. Yeah, I definitely did not. Oh, you know what I've just realized? Yep, being in the ocean is gonna make getting hide super easy. I've always felt like, especially on the island, the best place to get hide is in the ocean. I'm not getting any of these kills because of my bleed. That sucks. <laughs> I didn't get credited for them at all. Like that that's that's terrible. Ugh, God damn it. Alright, let's see. What should we be leveling? Also, stat-wise, um, we're obviously missing oxygen, which is huge. It's probably not even hidden. Um and then the movement speed is not there either. Uh, I think people did confirm for me that on the Baryonyx, the oxygen stat isn't just, you know, hidden away and it doesn't have points hidden in the back, which is what it can have, even though it's not visible for you. It can still have points. But uh, I think it's been confirmed that they definitely do not. Yeah, I can't kill that. <laughs> I really wanted to do, but no, that's not going to happen. Uh, yeah, so that's huge. That means that uh, water tames, you know, the stats that we're getting may look like really high stats but they might just be the new average especially now without movement speed and and oxygen because i'm pretty sure even water creatures had the oxygen stat hidden before i don't know i'll have to do an, a little bit of testing hop into single player spawn in the uh the tech binoculars and then just have a little luck i want to kill you for some chitin because you guys give tons and tons of chitin and i feel like you're moving a lot faster than i thought you would hmm, here we go all right we'll just chill right here with you all right, come on. Yeah, the ocean's actually really good for pretty much like a ton amount of resources. I'm not actually able to hit them at all here. What the hell is happening? Let me, let me get you. There we go. There we go. Nice. Yeah, so um, are we? Are you going to like move into a spit? Yeah, I think he's trying to. No, no, no. Okay, we're good. Okay, yeah. I thought he was going to try and move to my back again where I can't hit him at all. Anyway, yeah. So the ocean's really good for hide. You can get tons of keratin down here and get a good amount of chitin from these guys, I do believe. Uh, yeah, lots of really nice things down here for sure. Hey, I got that kill. Nice. Let me let me harvest you up. Decent amount of chitin there. Not bad at all. Um, yeah, we got that guy over there. I'm not even going to bother going near it. Let's go over in this direction. So I just, I want to like dive deep and take a little look. I can already see the border of the map, which really sucks. Like that looks terrible. <sighs> Why didn't they just expand it a little bit more? This is so stupid looking. <laughs> like... We talk about how dumb that looks like the border ends here sure but like it ends it expands for like another like meter and then, and then that's it you know that's the end of the ocean honestly they should have just made the island like i don't know maybe extend out the ocean by like twice the amount that it currently is like you've already redone a huge amount of it probably wouldn't have really taken that much effort to uh do that additionally um probably shouldn't even touch those ammonites because i don't want to get biled which would mean that everything would come and attack me. Um, things that I might not even see. If we see any Eoptrids, we could probably go ahead and kill them. They're another good way of getting the uh, the Black Pearls. But I guarantee nowadays it's going to be a lot harder to find them because now there's actual, like, you know, stuff on the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Before it was just bare and barren, but now it's uh, it's got some it's got some life to it. Just a little bit. I mean, like a good amount. Yeah, no, this is a decent amount. It's probably going to look really cool at nighttime when um, when you don't have the fog effect thingy turned off because obviously then you have like natural kind of light appearing from down here. So yeah, really cool. Definitely super excited to experience that another time when I don't disable the fog. What are you doing this deep? 120. Okay, not bad at all. Let's go ahead and kill you though because you guys give tons of oil and you will also give uh, a bunch of hide as well. Give me all of it. I want every last little bit. And also, I think I need your blubber eventually. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and kill this dude. Oh, crap. Everybody's getting pissed that I'm killing him. All right, let's see. What, uh, what level are you? Can't see it all. Oh, level 45, I think it said. All right. And angler fish as well could be pretty handy to kill. I do have a little bit of angler gel from drops. So, we, we're not desperate for it. <gasps> oh, what the hell? We what? Oh, my God. I didn't even see that. What the hell? I legitimately did not see that jellyfish. Where the hell did it come from? Am I just blind? Was I just getting distracted by the sharks and the angler fish? What the hell? I hated that. I hated every bit of that. Holy crap. Come here, bro. Come on. Come to me. 
Come. Oh, no, you're good. You're good. I thought you were like still swimming away. <gasps> oh, that could have been so bad. I didn't even see that freaking thing. Where did it come from? It must have just come from below. I'm going to look at the footage and it's going to be so obvious, but I genuinely did not see that. Oh my God. Yeah, that could have been really bad. All right, let me harvest you up. Thank you. Where's my, uh, where? Yeah, there you are. Cool. <laughs> I was trying to find my, like, my delicious, uh, fudge maker. They're, um, I think it's the actual, the, the drop that they produce, right? I know it's definitely the, uh, the alpha lead sickness. It looks like a big piece of fudge and I love it. It looks so delicious. I love fudge. All right, let's, let's get this dude killed. What the hell is that the, is that an obelisk up there? I think it might be that like glowy thing. All right, come on, bro. You know what? Another thing that we could actually try to hunt down eventually is um, some of the deep sea loot crates. I don't know if they're all in the same spots, but also I guarantee that my old kind of like map that I have in my head probably doesn't apply nowadays because I guarantee that they, uh, the areas are a lot harder to recognize. So yeah, but I remember back in the day, that was like the thing to do. Everybody was just like in the ocean for like so long and you'd only ever really find like one or two of them. So it was kind of crazy. Can we get this thing fully eaten? Give me the rest of it. Thank you. Oh my God, we're getting tons of oil. Yes, okay. That's gonna be huge. So far, I've really not been harvesting it. It's mostly been my dung beetle, but yeah, killing Basilos is gonna help out a ton as well. Let's do that. Um, Let's try and kill some more of those for sure. And let's see, anything else? there? Yeah, grab those. Sure, why not? Uh, Maybe I'll grab these too. I'm not getting super weight down, am I? because we don't have a crazy amount of weight on this dude. All right, let's see. Let's uh, pump up the health a little bit. Maybe get that up to like 8K if we can. Probably should have went for more melee immediately, but it's all good. We'll, uh, we'll work on that too. Let me see. Anything else to kill? Maybe I'll quickly just get some healing going because I'm looking really bloody. Like this is, yeah, this is definitely like, <laughs> I can't remember exactly which jaws it is. One of them he gets like pretty bloody in though, right? I'm thinking maybe it might be two, although no, it's probably not. And also, I just realized I dropped all my meat. Crap. Okay, we got to go for some more. Yeah, I think in Jaws 2, Jaws gets, uh, like, burnt, right? Yeah, towards the end, I think he does. So maybe not that one. I can't remember which one he gets super bloody in, though. Honestly, watching anything but the first one nowadays is just a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's it's not really worth it. Just just watch the first one. If you've never seen Jaws for whatever reason, I know there's a lot of, uh, you know, I, I'm going to say the younger generation and really age myself there. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it's a classic movie. Oh my God. It's probably one of the first horror movies I ever watched. And I probably saw it when I was like five, which is, sounds like horrible parenting, but they didn't know. <laughs> oh my God. All right, let's see. Can we heal? Yeah, let's get some healing going. Oh yeah, more dolphins, hello. Let's go ahead and, nope, can't get you. Gotta fully turn around, lure you into my mouth. There we go. All right, and let me get you as well. Which heals quicker? I feel like, it almost kind of seems like the fish meat is, but no, definitely the regular meat. Yeah, 100%. Because we're getting the healing factor just naturally, and then we're also like getting a ton there as well. So yeah, definitely much better. Need to kill some more dolphins then, uh, or ichthy, or, no, they're not called ichthy one, it's ichthyosaurus. There we go, words. Um, anyway, we got a couple megalodoodles over here. I should probably be checking them before I'm going in and killing them, because, you know, I mean, <laughs> it would be kind of nice to get some more. Uh, I don't mind if we don't get them today, but it definitely would be nice to at least be checking them and not accidentally killing a 150, because that totally will happen at some stage. Is that other one dead? Did I kill him? Yeah, I definitely killed him. Yeah, no, he bled out 100%. All right, let's go ahead and kill this turtle then as well, because why not? A little bit of uh, keratin. Come on, bro. Come on. Here we go. A little bit more. All right, what do we got down there? What level? Uh, level five, really? Why, why do you even exist? Just stop. Just stop existing. Here we go. Oh, yeah, there's tons of them here. Level 25 there as well. What level is that one? Ooh, I can't read that. What does that say? Eh, it's a low level. It's already dead. Yeah, level 15. Terrible. Alrighty. So eventually when we have some uh, some decent megalodons, we might actually take on one of the water caves. That actually could be kind of fun. I don't think I've done those in a long time. Definitely been two years because uh, last time I did a lot of stuff on the island was in um, the 100 days video that I did, which uh, yeah, that's that's been two years ago now. It's crazy. All right, uh, no regular meat. I mean, like, it does... Oh, that's definitely not... That's hardly really doing anything at all. Yeah, they like, uh, regular meat, so we gotta be... 
We gotta be killing humans, maybe. Uh, I don't know if I can find any. We'll kill some. But we do have a little ichthy, uh, ichthyosaur over here. Come on, bro. You know what? Where exactly are we? Uh, yeah, I can't remember where the drops would have been around here. I feel like there's probably one down there somewhere, but yeah, I can't exactly remember. Also, with the under, with the deep sea loot crates in the island, I do remember that it would only ever be like two of them on the map at the same time. So it was kind of awful, not super great. Hello, level 40. Look at your little bodyguards. They're all just like stuck in stasis almost. All right, how's this gonna work? Are we gonna be okay? We might be okay. This is gonna hurt a lot though. You know, we're actually destroying them. Oh, wow, okay. Dude, they should add like a, a tail whip attack to the shark as well. It wouldn't make a whole lot of sense, but it would be really, really cool. <laughs> All right, come here, bro. You and me together. Let me just give you a couple nice little kisses here. Come on. Uh, 130, okay, wow. Yeah, that's a high level Manta. Damn, all right. You know, I haven't actually tamed a Manta in a long time. I remember the first time when they were first added, they were really awful to tame because I don't know just I think we just couldn't get them to de-aggro or whatever um I guess maybe bug repellent probably would work underwater potentially I can't remember if we tried that it's been so long since I think I've actually tamed one genuinely don't think that they're a great creature at all <laughs> they're pretty fun I think from what I remember <laughs> but again it's been so long I know you can jump out of the water with them but uh, I think if they touch the land, they instantly die, right? Yeah, I didn't get the kill on you. I, obviously, we still get the resources. That's great. Exactly 200. Perfect. But um, yeah, that's that's uh, that's not great. Let's go ahead and do this. Nice. And grab that. And we get a little bit of extra normal meat. So let's go ahead and eat all that. The other thing I'm just now considering is where the hell am I going to put this thing? Because I can't bring it back with me. Hmm. Maybe I'll just park it at Axe's uh, little uh, water pen area. I don't know. Just I'll just park it there and just see if he notices. He might not. And then we'll just have like a free parking space. We'll be all good. Um, yeah, I don't have like a water pen yet, so we're definitely gonna need to make one at some stage. Hundred percent. All right, let's uh, let's go ahead and kill you. Nice. Thank you. Yeah. Maybe what I'll do is I don't want to travel too far, especially the fact that we're not going with like a crazy amount of health right now. So if we can at least get somewhat closer to where we're actually supposed to be, then we'll be good. At least if I can kind of get back to my barrier, I'll get him on follow and we'll head a little bit more north from here. But um, yeah, let me deal with this guy. Definitely want to just be finding any Megalodons on the way and just killing them if they're not good, like this one right here. So yeah, let me, let me go ahead and just focus on doing this then. Oh man, oh, yeah, this is uh, this is uh, I don't know, it feels nice. Definitely feels nice. Megalodons, they're cool creatures. I wish I would have given them more time in the past. But with the bleed, with the pack bonus, they're a lot better now. And there we go. No hide at all though, unfortunately. Kinda sucks. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We need to check this out. Look at that. Oh, the dorsal fin sticking out, creating that like little ripple in the water. What the hell just happened there? <laughs> I sunk down and then I came back up. Okay. Yeah, that's really cool. That is actually really, really nice. Even just like kind of being close to the surface, we still get like a little bit of a ripple there. You see that? That was really nice. Damn. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> oh my God. Oh man. Yeah, I, I love sharks. Sharks are great. I'm not like in real life, but like they're pretty cool in the game too. And we're out of stem. Wow. You know what else? These guys should have a breach attack. Yeah, just jumping out of the water grabbing uh pelagornis probably you know just just like this you know you hit it here and then you just jump out of the water and you grab it that would be perfect are you a high level i feel like you're a high level i think i saw its level i think it said 135 but maybe it didn't i'm not sure anyway yeah i don't know that would be really cool they should do that honestly they should do so many things i, I wish that they would just do things <laughs> oh my god even like you know they added some extra stuff to this guy, but he's still so basic. He's got one attack. That's it. And then like no emotes, no nothing. Just one bite attack. And that's all you can do. That and moving around, which is, you know, pretty acceptable that they added the moving around thing. But um, I feel like most creatures might have that already. I don't really know. Anyway, <laughs> some people are not going to get that. That was like a weird little joke. Anyway, yeah, let's, uh, let's see. Where's my Barry? Where about I leave you, bro? I feel like it might be around here. Mm, don't know if it was these rocks. Oh, yeah. I think it's these next rocks up ahead. 
Yeah, there he is. Nice. Okay, we'll get him on follow. We'll uh, we'll head pretty much right up to Axeman and mine, uh, our little uh, shared water pen that we have together, that we built together. Um, I'll just put him right up there. <laughs> Holy God. Come on, bro. You and me. Come on. Let's go. You're going to miss the boat. Here we go. <laughs> is he able to keep up? Uh, where is he? Wait, what? 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 What happened? Why, why didn't you get into the water? What the hell? I had you on follow. Wait, what are you fighting or doing? I don't know what the hell you're doing. I got so many manta on me, bro. You could have just come. Where are you? Why aren't you just... What? Why does it not want to follow me? What the hell was that? That was so unnecessary. Did I put you on passive flee? No, you're on neutral. What the hell was that? What? what? I'm so, I'm just beyond confused. That's very confusing. Why did you not just follow me? Okay, cool. Anyway, yeah, great. Yeah, that was really strange. I don't understand. <laughs> Alrighty, let's uh, swim a little bit further up in this direction. Uh, whereabouts does he have his little pen? Um, oh yeah, it's way further up. Yeah, I think it's like, oh, I was gonna try and show you. Whereabouts is it? I think it's like right around here, ish. Yeah, cause I think that's where he lives. Nice. Alrighty, let's keep swimming then. Another basslo down there, actually. I think I might have looked at you. And I'm not sure if I did. And I almost kind of just want to go down and kill it, so let's do that. Are you going to follow me? Uh, no, you are not. You definitely are not. That's kind of silly that you won't dive with me, but alright, cool. It's all good. If you don't like diving, that's that's fine. We'll just uh, I'll just go alone. Here we go. Come on. Get these stupid manta first. Things are so annoying. Oh crap, there's so many of them. Oh no, they keep coming. Get away. You guys weren't even here at the beginning. Like some of you guys are just swimming in now, joining the fun. Not even fair. Here we go. All right, what do we got? Give me all of that oil. Yeah, this is definitely the best way to get oil, I would say. Hey, look, now you followed me down. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> I just thought he didn't want to come down because like, you know, if you're on a barry and it's not following you and you hop off deep in the water, it will swim to the surface. And I figured it was probably because it favors the surface, maybe, potentially. I don't know. But I guess not. I, I don't really know why it didn't follow me. And now it's down here, so that's cool. <laughs> it would just It's probably best to just not question things, in all honesty. Um, yeah. Go ahead and eat this guy. Give me the rest. Oh, yeah. Even more than last time. Wow, okay, yeah. We're going back with, like... 600 plus right now. This is great. All right, can I even carry all this? Um, definitely not if I carry the rest of this stuff. So let's um, let's drop the majority. <laughs> yeah, wanna wanna definitely be keeping this oil. Although I guess I could put the oil onto my um, onto my Barry. Yeah, I could definitely do that. I think I might do that because I'm gonna be going back. What the? <laughs> what do they? Why did they leave like that? Look at that. That's so weird. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be going back on the Bowery anyway, so let me swim up to the surface, and we will do this real quick. We'll just chuck it all on there. How much do we have? Uh, wow, okay, yeah, 638. Nice. That is a huge amount. <gasps> Hello. There's a Megalodoodle over there. All right, here you go. Enjoy. Oh, you, I think, oh, no, you didn't get a little bit. You must have just, I must have just looked at the pieces as they went in. Um, level 20, level, no, I thought you were Megalodon. Nope. Alright, cool. Let's see. Let's keep going. Alright, here is the shared water pen. Lovely. Let's go ahead and get my guy right up in here. Um, here we go. Can I, like, point him up now, maybe? Uh, you know what? Let's point him down, see what that kind of looks like. Can I even do that? Uh, ooh, let me point down? No. I, uh, I can't do it. Damn it. Alright, let's point up then. I was hoping to, like, put the, uh, the tail sticking up like that one right there, but I guess not. Uh, I thought I just heard something there. Oh, is he online? No, he's not. Okay. Claimable in, what did that say? Eight days almost? Dude, that's going to be huge for us. We should get that. <laughs> hey, look, my one's better. Screw you, X-Man. You got a terrible, a terrible Megalodon compared to my amazing Megalodon in our shared, <laughs> shared water pen. Um, <laughs> Anyway, we're just gonna leave now. Uh, can I get out? There we go. Nice. So we got the Megalodon. It's pretty awesome. Um, we're definitely gonna be working on trying to get some more. Maybe I'll make a new water pen for sharing eventually as well. 
But um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have to head back to base now. Let's see. Let me go ahead and take this off and be a smart boy. Although I'm still pretty cold though. It's all good. All right, guys. Well, if you have enjoyed this one, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. I'm definitely gonna use that megalodon a bunch going forward just to collect up some more oil because I'd love to just max out both of my generators with all of um with all of the gasoline. But um, yeah, we're also gonna be able to use it to get some hide. We didn't get a huge amount today, but if you kill the bigger things, you get a ton of hide. So definitely need to be working on that too. But anyway, if you have enjoyed this one, hit the like button. If you want to see more like this, subscribe, do all that good stuff, and yeah, I'll catch you in the next one. A little spit on your face there. <laughs> That's disgusting. Uh...